Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of STL Thrifts. Got some pretty good stuff this week from my local St. Louis Goodwill bins. If you're new to the channel, you're probably wondering what's going on. But every Sunday morning, I do a new video showing you what I got that week at my local Good Goodwill bins here in St. Louis. Found this cool dino action figure. I'm not sure what it's to, but I looked it up on eBay using Google Lens, and it goes for around $40, so I picked it up. Over here, got some media, Pokemon, VHS. Our VHS at our bins, we're pretty lucky. They're only $0.05 cents per VHS. So if you see a good VHS, it's usually worth picking up. So I got the two Pokemon, this Digimon, as well as this Rugrats VHS over here. A couple video games. Got Guitar Hero 2 for the Xbox 360 as well as Dead Island, Riptide, and of course, Wii Fit Plus for the Nintendo Wii. Then to round it out, got a few books. I always pick up these little critter books. I sell them for lots on eBay. You know, 30 of them sell for around $30. Looking Find X-Men was pretty cool. Goosebumps, and then Animorphs. I do have an Animorphs collection going. This is kind of a different style. Usually they're a soft, it's like a hard, cover so i'll add that to the collection there got a thermopro humidity temperature monitor got a nice 35 millimeter camera this pentax hopefully we'll go for around 40 dollars got this ti84 calculator good condition unfortunately these have gone down in value they don't really sell for a whole lot on ebay but hopefully around 20 to 25 dollars for that net Got a CD player. I usually get around ten dollars plus shipping for these. Got a water pick. Hopefully, you get forty fifty bucks. They're, they are pretty nice. It's got the model number on there. Should be easy to look up. Got this Vera Bradley camera bag. It's got a nice pattern on the inside. But hopefully, we'll get around twenty bucks for that. Found this nice Hurley jacket. It is an extra 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 large, but that's a good brand to be on the lookout for. Hopefully, we'll get twenty bucks for that. A few Magic the Gathering cards just to have around. And then this nice set of Adams GT. Tight lies, irons that hopefully I'll get somewhere between 50 and 100 bucks on eBay for plus shipping. So we'll see. Just because a good set of irons does go for a decent amount, even if it's an older, less, less known brand like Adams. But that's everything I got for you guys this week. Again, if you guys enjoyed the content, Make sure to like the, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we'll catch you all next time.